Hi, I'm Tiam Singh. I'm going to show you how I use the piping feature to modify the tray width of a cable tray that I've just modeled. Hope you find this tip useful in your work. I'm in the piping application and I'm going to select modify spec and ball for pipe. Cable trays and pipes are using the same hierarchy. And now you can see the system fetch the brand member of the cable tray just like they would in a pipe. And the ball size is 150. I use Ctrl A to select all branch member. And now I will do a right click and select modify ball. I select the desired ball which is 450 mm. The first thing the application will do is to go to each branch member and look at the spec ref and find the equivalent spec ref for size 450 width. At the bottom right of the screen, the green color box will show you which are the components that have been found and there are actually none that are not found. I'll go ahead and press apply to replace the existing component with the new component. Unlike piping material, Cable tray material has got different width and they are not symmetric or round. So at the end of the cable tray, you can see that the cable tray get disconnected. So for this, what we need to do is just finish up the modification by reconnecting the last portion of the cable tray. We hope this will save you some time in your work in cable tray modeling and modification. See you again soon. Bye.